finding your way around. How you find your way around a Moodle site depends on the administrator's settings, the theme or background used, and how up-to-date your version of Moodle is. Some Moodle sites have attractive front pages, Moodle Cloud sites simply have the login box, and learn.moodle.org always uses the latest version of Moodle with a theme called Boost. Let's log in. Often, when you log in, you're directed to a personalised, customizable page called your dashboard. Here, you'll see an overview of the courses that you're enrolled in. We explore this further in our video called Dashboard. Over on the left, you'll see a navigation or nav drawer with useful links, for example, to your site's front page or site home. Perhaps your administrator directs you to the site home when you log in, in which case you can access the dashboard by clicking the link in the nav drawer. This nav drawer also allows you to see the courses you're enrolled in, so you can access them either by clicking the link in the nav drawer or the link in the course overview. The nav drawer can be collapsed or closed by clicking the hamburger icon top left to free up more space. You can open it again by clicking it again. Over on the right is a user menu, also with useful links. For example, in your preferences page, you can edit your profile, change your password, select the language you want Moodle to display in and decide the text editor you want when typing in text. As with many modern websites, you have icons for messages and notifications. From the Messages menu, you can read and send messages, manage your contacts, and from the COG, select who you want to exchange messages with and how to be notified of new messages. Notifications works in a similar way. You can view notifications, mark them as read, and from the COG icon, access your preferences. This site also has global search. Let's go back to the dashboard and now let's go into our user Sam's practice course where she's learning how to teach with Moodle. We can either click the link in the nav drawer or the link in the course overview. Once inside the course, notice that the nav drawer links have changed to reflect what's happening in the course. There's a participants link, a badges link to see which badges are available, competences are enabled on this site, grades and the topic numbers here are for sections within the course. We'll look at how to edit and explore these in a later video. Further down again, she can access her dashboard, site home, a content bank which we'll explore in another video and other courses she's enrolled in.